Mama, I want to be a bee. Why do you want to be a bee? Because then I wouldn't get any mosquito bites. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's talk about this video now, Papa. So what are you doing here? I am changing the earth. I'm, I'm forming the land into a garden bed. For the? For the strawberries. We moved all the strawberries from where I'm working right now. And I'm making a new home for them. And they're, they're off to the side on a piece of plastic just languishing away while I slave away on their new home. And so? And so I'm, I'm spending lots of time and, and efforts and goofiness on transforming the earth to make a new home for them. But I've thought about it for a long time and I want to try what I was thinking of, so I'm doing it. Okay. Okay. You know, to anyone else looking on, uh, to my wife, she, I'm, I'm guessing that she's looking at all this and thinking, I don't think he's really doing it for the comfort of the strawberries. Yeah. <laughs> I think he's doing it for his own comfort to, to satisfy himself. If, if the strawberries do all right by it, then yahoo, but I think he's doing it for him. <laughs> and, and that would probably be true to a large extent. <laughs> but there you are. That's how it is. Okay, so tell me something about that one here. The... Well... I'm building a a one by a, a two by four deck with a skirt under it to hold the blocks from spreading, and it will be a wonderful place to sit whenever I feel like sitting. And that's that's a particularly wonderful aspect of what I'm doing. Is have a place to sit when I sit. Ah, uh, my favorite critic has just asked me about what I said and shown up a goof that I said. It's not a 2 by 4 deck, it's a 2 by 10 deck with a 2 by 4 skirt coming down from it to hold the blocks from spreading. So now I've, I've achieved technical perfection in, in my, what I'm telling you. There you go. Oh, I've been caught doing surgery to fix uh, an oversight of providing water for the strawberry bed, but I'm going into my unorthodox underground water connection setup on my sprinkler system and getting it fixed, making a box and setting a lid for it. And now I've got water coming to the bed. And now we are going to position the beast for having a shredding party. Shred all of the yard waste and so forth from the past oh, from eight, last year. eight or nine months. Yeah, from last year. And shred it all up into a, a mulch. And we'll use it on the strawberry bed and in some other projects as well. Make use of all that stuff. It's accumulated for quite some time now. You know, do that a couple times a year. Cut it all up. Wonderful stuff. Make use of. Spreading the Shredder Party's proceeds onto the strawberry bed and trying to avoid the mosquitoes. And the last part's the most challenging part. Oh, 
we're gonna go ahead and grab some bagged garden soil to top off the shredded material we've already spreaded. And hope that the strawberries are happy with the, the preparations here. We shall soon see. It's going to go. It's an experiment. And we'll top all this off with some fabric here shortly. Did you put some coffee grounds there? Did you mix it? Not here. Not there. No. It'll be, the coffee grounds will be in the stuff we shredded from the compost bins that are going to go in when we plant each individual plant. Oh, in each holes? Yeah. Okay. Come on. <laughs> Grab that. A much higher quality staple. They're galvanized. I mentioned they're heavier and they're galvanized. Mm -hmm. the six inches would just barely get into the dirt. These will get in there and, and make a secure hole. Fabric installed, and then we're gonna start cutting some holes for all the plants to go in too. Seems like we're cutting out a lot of fabric for having covered it all, but this is this is what I had pictured in my head to do. So that's what we're going with. We'll see how it goes. That's a lot of holes. So this yeah. bed is like twice the size of the other beds. It's huge. Mm, it's a little bit bigger. I don't know if it's twice as big. Can we go? It's okay. Doing my best to keep the mosquitoes at bay. You'd think that this, the smell from burning that landscape fabric would make the mosquitoes stay away, but it doesn't work like that. Cuts the fabric and melts the edges at the same time so it doesn't come, come apart where you cut it. I'm only doing this one right now because I have to reach in here and grab a hold of this pipe. It's not a large loaf of black Swiss cheese, it's a strawberry bed. <laughs> That's right. 